Hey, so I had a client who came over with this lovely top, which has some circular beads, some hanging beads and some sequins as well. Um, and this needs to be reduced by in the waist by about two inches. So I'm taking out about half an inch per dart to nothing at the bust. Um, so just measure how much you need to remove first and have a look at the beads that are in the way. Um, and then the best way to get rid of these is with pliers. Um, just be careful not to pull at the threads and sometimes the beads can kind of pop out everywhere so um, uh, yeah just be careful where they end up. So what you want to do is end up with a gap and then just close it with your hands on the inside and just see right okay that seems to be the right amount um, and just keep going down the dart um, taking those beads out. Then what you want to do is if you turn it over and you can have a look on the inside um, and fold that dart and you can then pin it so you now have your new dart position and that's where you're going to um, then sew. You can also sew this by hand, it doesn't have to be done um, with a machine so at this point you could just get a needle and thread and kind of sew down that line. You also want to make sure while you're pinning that you haven't got any beads stuck um, inside the dart. So just check from the front that all the beads are um, at the front of the top and nothing is inside the dart. So with the sewing machine, I usually use a zipper foot. So you've got a gap on the side. This will enable you to sew right up close to the beads so you get a really nice finish. Um, at the end. So just so I usually do from the waist um, going up to the bust. If you're finding this useful please subscribe and like this video and follow for more sewing tips. Finish just have a little check that again you haven't got any beads stuck inside the dart um, and there you have it you've got um, an adjusted beaded top obviously check your measurements afterwards and if you need to make any further adjustments you just um, follow that process again hope you found this helpful